here with Ted Frank of Belleville, who's just published a book, written a book, I should say, called Baseball, the Unfair Sport. And Ted, uh, tell the viewers, first of all, what uh, motivated you to write this book. Well, I watch a lot of baseball games. Being an old person, I, I've seen many in my day. And I, by watching, I came, up with, I came up with a lot of unfair situations in the game. And I talked to many of my friends and seemed to know not much about them. So I just thought that if people don't know this, uh, I'm going to get these unfair situations out to the public, let everybody know what's unfair about baseball. In a nutshell, what is the thing that you're seeing as being unfair about baseball? I know it, it, it has to do with left-handed hitters. Uh, yes, that's the, the main thing. The left-handed hitters have such an advantage because they bat three-fourths of the time against right-handed pitchers. And everybody should know that uh, all baseball players hit opposite-hand pitching better than hit same-side pitching. So left-handers have a big advantage there because three-fourths of the pitchers are right-handed. That's pretty simple. But and, and many these people are, don't know it. And these are things that a lot of people don't know. So when you started diving into these numbers a little bit and started talking to people, a lot of people are unaware of these situations. Yes, yes they're, unfair. Uh, they're unaware of the unfair situations. Uh, probably all of them, and there are many more unfair situations, uh, such as uh, you've got third baseman running into rails and brick walls out there, and, and Alan Craig lost uh, three-fourths of a year by running into the right field wall, uh, just chasing balls. Uh, why aren't the walls padded? Uh, why isn't there a line around the field that is out of play before they run into that wall? Things that can be corrected very easily are not corrected. And what was the biggest challenge about writing this book? Is it, uh, and maybe one of the goals, is it to change perception of how people see the game or to look at a game in possibly in a different light? I think that once they read the book, they'll look at the game in a different light. And uh, if they're made aware of all these uh, things that I call inequities, uh, yes, they'll, they'll look at the book, uh, they'll look at the game a lot differently. And just in a nutshell, Ted, uh, basically lefties don't do well against left-handed pitching traditionally, yet they remain on major league rosters. That's right. If you watch more than two baseball games, you'll see some left-handed pitchers come in late in the game and pitch to these left-handed wonders who think they're, <laughs> they're really good and sometimes they aren't so good against left-handers. Yeah. And you've, uh, you've got 600 copies of the book out now, correct? You've had 600 copies of this book actually printed, and it's available to the public. That's correct, Dave. And one person read the book who enjoyed it quite well. You want to share that story? Uh, yes, that's uh, Mike Shannon. I happen to know him pretty well, and I, I gave him a, a book, and uh, he walked away saying, yes, I want to see what's unfair about baseball. And then six days later, he called me. I wasn't at home, but he left a message on my answering machine it goes something like this. Ted, this is Mike Shannon. Read your book. I really, really, really enjoyed it. Very interesting, he said. What I want to know is where I can get eight more copies of it. He wanted to buy the book and give it to, of course, Matheny and La Russa and Herzog and all of his buddies. And uh, he did. Bought eight more copies. And uh, I guess he gave one to most everybody important. That's one way to get the news out there, I guess. And that had to be one of the highlights. Of, oh, of I was, uh, yeah, I was ecstatic that he liked the book that much. Yeah. He really did enjoy it. And he got it all. Yeah, some people get about half the book, some get three quarters, and some get it all, and Mike Shannon got it all, believe me. And uh, quickly tell people, Ted, how they can uh, get a copy of your book. Well, uh, the easiest way right now is to go on AmazonBooks.com. It's available in paperback on there for $9.95 new and $6.95 used. It's also available at uh, my publisher and www.baseballtheunfairsport.com and also on ebook at $6.99 on Amazon Books and uh, Barnes and Noble. Okay. So that's three ways you can get the book. And if not, just get hold of me. I'll give you a book. Okay, this has been Ted Frank talking about his book, <laughs> Baseball the Unfair Sport. Uh, probably we went. over time. <laughs> no, that's okay. Oh, you can edit something out. Oh well, yeah, we able. It was pretty good though. We as long as you don't. Oops, as long as you don't go too long. Okay, let me.